Well, hello, boys and girls. My name is Seth Usan, and today I'm going to show you how to make your ideal smoothie. Let's get started. I want to start off with the base. With the base, we are trying to make sure that we have the consistency and the texture of our smoothie. The liquid is going to basically have the consistency of a smooth taste in your smoothie. Fourth cup of water. In your water, we will start off with our oats. And this is where you get a lot of your carbohydrates from. Oatmeal especially is a good way to get your uh, carbohydrates in. And here we go. This is about a fourth cup of oatmeal. Put it in. Next, um, the reason why we make a smoothie is because a smoothie is a quick and easy way to consume all the calories that your body needs for the day. So the reason why we make the smoothie is because it's a very good way to not only recover, but it's also a good way to start off your day. If you don't feel yourself properly, you cannot be able to perform properly. After we added in our oats, we will uh, start putting in our soft fruit, which consists of a banana. And it doesn't matter what kind of banana you put, but I like to put either a dull plantation banana or uh, apple banana. So I put that in. Tangerine is a good source of vitamin C, which is very helpful for your immune system. Next, you want to grab three of your strawberries. One, two, and... Nice. Yep. A smoothie is a very good way of putting as much ingredients and you can also put it in greens. There we're going to get a handful of spinach right here, put it in, make sure you stack it so you want to get it all compacted. Ooh. Then we add in a handful of carrots. These are baby carrots, so about one, two, three, four baby carrots. There you go. And then a handful of blueberries, which is about... Eight blueberries, half an apple, cut it here real fast. And here you go, as you can see. Put those in. And preparation is key, so I suggest that you prep all your food in. So you have all the needed ingredients to put in your smoothie. Add a little bit of cinnamon. Nice. So we're gonna add in our beneficial fats. So as much as calories these are a lot of carbohydrates, a lot of minerals and nutrients. We're also going to add in a high uh, beneficial fats, which will come, which will come from our nuts. Right here, I have a bunch of sliced almonds, a decent amount, not too much. It's like you have to find that perfect amount. So once we put in our sliced almonds, next we have the seeds, and then we put in a little of, of that. Next, we have to make our smoothie creamy milk or yogurt. Now, the consistency of how you make your smoothie, it all depends on you. Some people like it smooth, some people like it with a little clump. So for me, I like mine to be very smooth. I have some yogurt. 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 Or anything that has anything with dairy is there so that it makes the smoothie have a creamy consistency taste. Uh, the banana also does that too as well. If you want your uh, smoothie to be cold, you're going to add in about a good couple pieces of ice. And that will give you a good, nice cold smoothie that you can enjoy. And then, once you have all your ingredients in, now we can blend it. Now, I like mine to be very liquidy. I'm going to gradually increase it. So first, we're going to stir up the nutrients, get them all mixed together. And then we're going to gradually increase it to it comes to about a liquid form and you just have to do it by observing. So I'm doing it based on observation. So as I can see, it's pretty, it's pretty liquidy. So based off of personal experiences. I really um, 
this is a good meal to make, especially for me since I'm an athlete and I burn off so much calories a day. So this is a perfect meal to have right before or after a game, whether if you're prepping for a specific practice or game and you're knowing that you're going to burn off a lot of calories, this is it. If you want to be able to perform and stay at where you want to be at, this is a good way to take it. And that concludes today's video, boys and girls, and I hope you enjoyed. I hope it was informative, and hope you guys have a good day. See ya.